time to go from the dumbbells to the barbells. So I'm glad you're ready for this step and I'm gonna teach you exactly how you're gonna set up. Number one, take your time. If you're nervous, you're like, oh my God, I've been wanting to go to the bar, but I'm really nervous, that's okay. So what we wanna do here is go under the barbell and where you wanna place this is on these muscles right here. So it's almost gonna act like a little shelf. I'm shelved into this and I always want to squat to stand up. Right, I don't just wanna like lift it like this, right? I'm going to squat to stand up. Perfect world, we go one, two, three. However, if you don't get it in three, that's okay. Figure it out, find your stance, right? And then nice and easy, you're gonna pull your hips back. At the same time, you're gonna drive those knees forward. So notice how my hips come back, my knees come forward. Hips come back, knees come forward. Until my knees are nice past my toes, I'm about at this length and then I'm gonna drive up from here. Now, if you're a tall girly like me, we tend to lean forward a little bit more. My short girls, I don't know how you do it, but <laughs> you'll be a little bit more upright. So again, hips come back, knees come forward. Take your time, take your time, take your time so you can really balance this out. If you feel like your heels are coming off of the ground, that means we need to strengthen those glutes and hamstrings. If you feel like you're falling back, that means we need to strengthen those quads. But again, take your time because this movement right here nice and slow is going to make you really fucking strong.